Either way, though, we get ourselves a DLC battle. Ooh, I haven't seen one of these in quite a while, I feel like. Besides, like, the many swords we had today. Oh, we have three swords in bracket today. Um, I believe so. It was Che, it was Helper, and it was... Hikari, right? I believe so. Yeah, Hikari. Yeah. So, we have the, the Joker versus the Aegis. Going for the... Uh, definitely a Lightning Buster. This definitely is, a very punishment. <laughs> this is going to be some fast-paced gameplay. So, a lot of the times, it may come down to not just who is making the right decision in certain moments, though that will obviously be a factor, but rather, how many decisions are you making and how quick are you making them? So, Chicken Quesadilla is just kind of deciding, like, hey, whenever you're off stage, I'm just going to throw out this down air. Like, whether or not it's correct in the moment may not matter, as long as he's making that choice. Very interesting gun off stage right there, kind of forced a summary tech, tech situation that case with Chicken Quesadilla's had to deal with. And now, again, we do have our send out, not for too long, going for the guns, going for the dragon up there, and trying to find a connection with the second one, but... Not gonna be enough, but I don't think it's too it's uh, too dangerous here as we see them finally get a more even percentage of building up right now. The get up attack gonna be taking chicken because it's a little bit out, and we're still playing with the mithra uh, as I say that. Going to the pyra, gain the down air, and then boom, we're gonna be going right back to the mithra for some extra fuck 50 60. Yeah, you're looking for you're looking for a fallen air here. Down so it means a lot. Joker without it. Our sand means no spike, which means that side B can be kind of a an operable recovery instead of just a, a sign of your own demise. And on stage, Mithra is just so tough to deal with. Speed to keep up with just about, and to not even keep up, to surpass just about anybody. Yeah, for sure. Even even Sonic himself can't really <laughs> has to kind of deal with Mithra's speed as as we see here. But we gotta deal with Arsene as well. Off stage, the gun coming in, We're trying to go for the uh, the Rebels guard, but not gonna be quite enough as you get the roll in. And again, Chicken's idea is able to just kind of come at the stage for free and even set up on the ledge here, trying to go for that down as you as you keep seeing does kind of at some point, and we try to get the Blazing Nova, barely getting the up B, and the second one gonna be connecting very very uh very, uh, what's the word? Nicely. Good job. And it's just what Mithra can do sometimes. Like, uh, to put it in perspective, right, Joker's X Factor is centered on that gauge, our set. It's how he is able to, for lack of a better phrase, win games. Nice. That was That was great. nice. Thankfully, Myth uh, Pyra and Mithra do give you the opportunity to close out stocks extremely cheaply with things like these edge guards looking for another one, but the drift to ledge just in the next time, as well as the blazing edge uh, finding the connection. Down air. Definitely down air, gonna be stuffing under cover from Arsene, and then without Arsene to mix the recovery angle a little bit, you're kind of at the mercy of your regular Joker Uppy. It's gonna be you falling to, again, the Blazing End from Pyra Mithra. And that was just a really good showcase of what, you know, going Mithra first and then Pyra can do. I, I want to really highlight that final stock, I believe, because... Sure, we can jump to it. Yeah, I, I want to really quickly just show this Edgeguard by Veeds, because that oh, was It was so good, crazy. please. Oh, it was so nice. Yeah. It was so, Ooh, so to good. The chip, just to get a little bit further into the forward tilt, so nice. But this is where I was saying at the beginning of the game, right? Regardless of the positioning, right? Like we saw the down air at ledge right here. We're seeing, uh, we're gonna see Burst go out here with a uh, neutral B edge guard, the Flame Nova. It's just about doing things in Joker's general direction. Because while Joker can move around characters extremely fluidly, as long as you're making choices and putting yourself in position to have things happen, you're no longer letting beats control the game. And Joker, at the end of the day, lives off of that game state control. Without that, with that sense of, uh, without that type of tempo in his favor, the amount of damage that even just Pyro throwing out up airs can do is monumental. Again, trying to go for that down air into the up smash, and it's such a great, great tool that Pyra has. Narrowly, uh, going a little bit too deep into the blast zone for that Blazing End, but the very, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, not the Blazing End, the Blazing Nova, but at the very least, we're able to come back and get these to 125%. We're jumping around the shield, we're going for the forward throw, we're trying to get that, blaze, that, uh, that Blazing Nova once more. We're off stage, we gotta go for the Mithra, and I think you just saved. Okay, there we go. Didn't save at the end. At some point, I thought they were gonna like drift away for too long. 
Okay. The See, look what happens. Look what happens when you cheer, when you cheer too early. At I, I was okay. So this is both cheering because I think Beats is a very cool player, and both. But the the fact that both of these two what's still gun out of shit. Let's sick. talk about it. I'm sick. I'm, I'm sick. sick. I'm sick. <laughs> I'm so here for it. We're learning. We're developing. The meta is being pushed. By Beats. Ooh. But slowly by Beats, by yeah, the way. It's him. He's him. He's him. He's making stuff up. It's great. He's definitely making stuff up. <laughs> and it's working very, very well. Nice. Not going for the gun there. It's like opting for the downer instead. Jordan trying to go for the poke. But thankfully, it's able to uh, check into AFK's video. It is able to come back off and kind of reverse the positioning here. This is where uh, Pyra can I'm sorry, not Pyra, but Mithra can really shine here. Missing the rest of that side B is going to be a little bit unfortunate. Or that, which, uh, that, that B special. Neutral B is switching over to Pyra. Playing into that win condition. Trying to pressure the platform, but Beats just. On a tear when it comes to these offstage interactions, knowing how to wait that extra beat, the tempo slowly heading to their favor, trying for a risky recovery, but it is going to work out in terms of giving them another chance. Yet, the delay from burst there. Man, these two are just like playing on different beats, trying to match their own tempos and see what they can make it. But the hurt box shifting, Pyra crouching just low enough to avoid the up smash, have to down smash there. But down smash wouldn't have killed. Our send is out right now, and we could get another edge guard here, but instead it's gonna be the up B from uh from uh, from burst. It's coming in clutch and finally beats it would bring us back to a one-to-one -one game. 79%, however, although our set is coming out, we get another footstool into the guns, into the back air. I love to see all of it. And unfortunately, our is going to be leaving, but Joker is not anything without his Arsene. He can definitely do a whole lot of damage here. And you can see that right here, right now. Feeds bringing it really, really quickly back, percent-wise. What are we throwing out here? Looking for the back end to try and scout the jump. An empty landing there from first, but it just missed. The empty line grab is missing there is so tough looking for the flat drop fair one as well beats putting out all of the stops but no up smash on the proper mm, drag down this is huge huge opportunity again air dodge up to make it back your mind we're seeing such a tight game between these two competitors as both of them are looking to swing at ghosts and try and find where they might be but jump was gone the reversal was there however beats is unfazed just gotta move on. Unfazed by that turn of Walk events. Along. Bro was like, because everyone in the entire like venue kind of just reacted when that happened. When you didn't have a jump, when you're trying to do uh, oh. Blazing Nova, and then it's like, he's just like, yeah, I knew that. Fool. <laughs> this was so beautiful, by the way. I, I completely agree. Like, they just always ready to, like, goldfish brain. Move yep. on to the next Goldfish one. brain. Yeah. <laughs> it's a thing, legitimately. As a competitor, you can always have to look towards the next game, the next interaction, the next moment, because every moment matters. Three, two, okay, yeah, this is just funny. Look, he, 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 we didn't get to see Burst's reaction, but it was definitely a case of ideas. <laughs> Thank you, Devin. Now <laughs> <laughs> throw, back air, back air. Do it again. Ooh, trying for the gun. It's a little extensions like that. Like those are the types of things where Joker like has the guarantee, but if he wants to push the push the envelope a little bit, you have to kind of make like that extra read at the end of your combo. And Beats willing to do so up to an early lead here in game number three. But the damage starting to rack up here first in the same type of brain. Like making one extra read, one extra idea might be the Oh. oh, I was about to say, Wait, where are we going? <laughs> like, <laughs> thankfully, Vs does not just like die immediately off of that because at least he just barely got back. But the prominence were both on the platform to boot. Definitely gonna be saying he's the blasting a little bit earlier than I expected. The shield wiggling, we were definitely wiggling that shield a whole lot here. Burst getting very confident, going for the Rebel's Guard, and that's like, that gets a whole bunch of Arsene charge up here. Chicken of case of idea is not deterred whatsoever. Per so, uh, our set is out, but I think that you know we have a little bit of confidence, or so a lot of confidence from Chicken of idea going for the pyro, going for the downer, trying to get the connection of smash, and we do. And he even features like that connected, that connected. That, not only did it connect, it closed off the stock at 89 uh, before the up smash, Oof. or after the up smash. Rather. I don't know. Tough. It's tough. <laughs> <laughs> T U F F tough. <laughs> 
I'm gonna see who the puppy is that's coming after this. <laughs> I love you. I love you. I love Dougley the puppy. <laughs> oh, GG's. It's okay, you have two socks. Definitely doable to deal with. Oh, yeah. uh, at least for checking two ideas. Veet has a little bit of a mountain to climb. He got the up, up there into the dirt, onto the down there, missing the back air, unfortunately. But not for nothing, it's completely even, at least until we get some more damage going here. Our Sen is out, so hopefully Veet does take this game right here. Or, no, sorry, this stock right here, right now. Yeah, getting the Arsen this early is certainly a. It's certainly a rough one unless you can find a Rebel's Guard, but in the same vein, Beats trying to find a reef here, trying to find a, an opportunity in order to close out the stock of his own. Down our up smash works for Joker with Arsene as well, and there it is! Oh, the up tilt! No! That was the stock, and unfortunately, Beats has to find another opening and this stock without Arsene! Beats is the best player of all time, but also sometimes things just kind of happen. That's I, tragedy. Tragedy has struck. Okay, I like the idea of using the Rebel's Guard in order to counteract the Blazing Nova, but it's not going to connect. Arsene is still at least you know, most of the way there. It could come out right here and at least take us off a little bit of the last stock, but we are one-to-one. -one. We're in game three. We cannot be fumbling right now. I know Beats can do it. He, I know he can. There's the back of your side, 158. You're still not dying. Oh, oh that's, that's huge. Oh, saving the jump, but not willing to go down there by the skin of his nose. <laughs> Making it pass it straight through, but the stock isn't quite gone just yet. The lack of Arsene just continuing to matter, but you want to be able to close out the stock before that meter fills. There and the go. back throw will do it just in the nick of time. Arsene for the final stock, a chance to snowball if you're mine. I can't wait, I can't wait to see it. It's gonna happen, going for the up tilt, not gonna be enough, and going for a dash attack either. Beats is already halfway through our send meter. Stop it, okay. The upper not gonna connect, but nah. Man, okay. Man. The, the thought, man, both players kind of scrambling in those final moments, but Pyra can just find these places to hunker down throughout that massive down air. Sweet or sour spot at that high percentage, doesn't matter as long as it hits. Covering yourself with multitude of options and uh, by rather covering mul a multitude of options with a singular one, that downer just being so big. We see it time and time again. 89 after the hit. I'm sorry. It's it, character's good. It's very solid. Character is crazy and burst played it quite well. Like just little things that go oh. your way uh, as uh, little little mix-ups in order to keep the, the damage minimum. Like mixing in di in as Beats was going for down throw back airs, which can sometimes, uh, you have to drift in while doing your RAR, which is a little bit tighter as Joker. Like, there's still